Give it up for the one, the only, Winnie Clark! So, inflation. <laughs> a bit of a buzzword these days, huh? Inflation. You folks feel frustrated with inflation? Yeah, well, here's my hot take on it. Inflation only affects you if you want to keep living the same quality of life or better. <laughs> so I've come up with a few innovative ideas to combat inflation, okay? Here we go. Number one, instead of Taco Tuesday, try Taco Shell Tuesday. <laughs> Grab some hard taco shells, put them in a Ziploc bag, bash them with a spoon, get some mayo, canned tomato, or any other condiment you have lying around, whip that up, and bam! Interesting new chip dish for dinner. <laughs> Number two, this is for those folks who are in a relationship or those who are dating, okay? Instead of taking your beloved out for a night on the town like you may have done this evening, just fuck. <laughs> Why see Van Gogh when you can go fuck in the comfort of your own home? <laughs> Number three, now this is probably the most simple yet most challenging for all of you. Delete your Amazon account. Wipe it out. Stop making it so easy for you to buy shit you don't need. <laughs> I know most people get a little weird with that last one. Now, if you implement two out of these three very specific tips, you could save a minimum of $76 a month, which could lead to a down payment of absolutely nothing ever. We're fucked. We're fucked. Shit, I'm so sorry. My name is Winnie. I I'm so happy to be here. Yeah, round of applause for yourself. I just want to get one thing clear, very clear right away, okay? I am wearing a uh, diamond gold feline belt of my own accord. Okay, this was a choice, cause fashion. Um, a little bit about me, I am a yoga teacher. Uh, I've been teaching yoga for 10 years, and thank you. And uh, something kind of big happened recently. I, uh, well, I've finally grown into my camel toe. <laughs> yeah, I just walked in to teach one day and bam, there it was. I heard this ominous voice be like, teacher training complete. I was like, where did that? Where did that come from? And I'm going to be honest with you, it's not as defined as I would like it to be, so I'm going to work really hard on getting that authentic toe structure. You know what I mean? And who knows, from there, clit's the limit. Maybe I could create a signature toe. <laughs> Ultimately, though, I just want a toe that young women can look up to and in at <laughs> and say, when I grow up, that's the kind of toe I'm looking to have. Um, I am in a relationship. I've been with my partner for 14 years. Yeah. Thank you. Well, you might feel differently after this next part. Uh, my partner and I are um, a bi-vaccinated couple. Yeah, I'm not gonna tell you which one is which, but I will tell you that he is a conspiracy theorist. <laughs> and I am a sheep. Let me tell you, the sexiest shit I have ever done in public is back him up when he's being a dickhead. He'll be talking to some vaxxers and be like, y'all, I'm just not a sheep, so... And their beady eyes will dart to me because they know I'm one of them. And I'm just standing behind him eating grass like... <laughs> yeah, I'm no sheep. But honestly, it benefits him that I am a sheep. Let me tell you why. I pay someone to rip the hair from my vagina based on racist beauty standards that were developed before I was born. And I know that he will eat it either way, but he prefers it childlike. <laughs> oh boy. You having fun? Are we having a good time? Good. I'm so glad. Um, I'm in my 30s now, 
And uh, thank you. Yeah, 30s is a sexy age, but I will tell you, things are changing, you know. You start, um, you start seeing your first signs of aging in your 30s, if you're white. <laughs> and I'm seeing it. I noticed a little bit of nipple wrinkling the other day, and I called my partner all over. I was like, hey, come over here. What the, f what, what is this, what is this? Bless his heart, he grazed it gently and said, oh, babe. That's just a little bit of nipple maturity. I said, what the fuck did you just say to me? I may be 34, but these tits are 16, okay? I bloomed late. Um, and, and you know, my, my body is also changing. Recently, um, I learned that uh, mopping, mopping makes me very horny. <laughs> I don't know if it's the movement or the patriarchy. <laughs> but every time I do it, my puss tingles the same way it did when I first watched Aladdin invite Jasmine onto his magic carpet. Oh, woo! Any Disney masturbators in the room? <laughs> Statistically, there are. So it's okay, no shame. I, um, I actually started masturbating really young, younger than most, I think, and uh, I miss it. <laughs> it was easier back then. It was just really a three to five second swirl a and you're done. You could bang a couple of those out before story time, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> when I was 12, my brother caught me masturbating and he did not like that. Mom! My mom comes running, and, uh, and he just tells her everything, fucking rat. <laughs> I am mortified. She looks mortified. I'm so filled with shame that I know I have to lie. So I'm like, no, I wasn't doing that. I was just itching it because it's really itchy. And I don't know if my mom just wasn't like emotionally ready to have this conversation with her 12 year old or if she actually believed me because she was like, well, how itchy is it? And I was like, it's really itchy. And, um, and it was summer, so she was like, well, maybe it's swimmer's itch. And I was like, yeah, that's probably what it is. So we should get out of here. And It wasn't the punchline yet, but that works, I think, still. Um, and then, for the rest of the day, I had to keep up this fucking facade. So every time I caught my mom staring over at me from the corner of my eye, I would just run to the nearest piece of furniture and rub my vagina all over it. That's it for me, everybody. You guys are so great. Thank you so much. Seriously, my friends, I love you. Thank you, 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 thank you. Thank you. One more time for Winnie Clark. Let's get the show go. We got two acts left first. We got 11 and his three, 11, the three piece band at 11. Guys, make some noise. World record holding 365 songs, 365 music videos, 365 days, 11. Little bit of nipple maturity. When I say rhythm, y'all say flow. Rhythm? Flow. Rhythm? Flow. Oh, man, the room's together. It's harmonizing. We're doing this thing again. I want to try something fun, okay? See if we can get on the same frequency. We're going to ohm together. It's a little Eastern special medicine. It's vibration. It's quantum. I'll talk about it later. But here we go. Ohm together. Follow me. Ohm. Magical as fuck, thank you. Keep it going. Oh. One more time, let's do it. Put it all into it. Feel it in your chest. Feel it right here. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Who's willing to let me go through their DMs to create... Oh, I'm sorry, I'm having a show here. I'm just kidding. Uh, who's willing to let me go through their DMs to get information to make a song about? It's like, fuck a DM, bro. I'm here with my girl. Are you trying to blow my cover, homie? You're, you're good. 
It's inconvenient? Never mind. <laughs> Anyone else? No? Okay, all right. Uh, DMs are too personal. And we all fucking do stupid shit. You're down? My God, put your hands together for this beautiful redhead man. Um, I hope you like drugs because that's your reward for being brave enough. You can always find a, a good stoner friend. Just pull up, uh, pull up your, your latest DMs here on your, on your IG. Oh, sorry, I didn't say stop the oming. Oh, um, thank you. Your DMs, this is your WhatsApp chat, specifically avoiding the DMs. Okay, okay, just go to one of these, no, randomly. That was fine, that was fine. That was go good. back, yeah. Go to random, and then, and then touch one randomly. Okay, yeah, whatever. You, don't scroll, touch that name, okay? <laughs> And then just read, uh, read, read that, read that line. Read, or, or, or I shouldn't know. This is the proof that I'm freestyling. This is what we're doing. I'm sorry, I got too close to you. I invaded your personal space. <laughs> Go ahead and read that line. Hi, Joe. This is Scott. How are you? <laughs> Hands together for this beautiful man. You can go sit down. <laughs> Joe needs to talk about s something with Scott. And for the super cool uh, girl with the pink hair that came in last minute in the show, what does Joe, yeah, you, what does Joe need to tell Scott so desperately? He just joined adult tap dance. <laughs> Phil, you got something that kind of feels like uh, maybe a, a smooth tap dancing thing, but like Joe's pretty psyched about it, and this is going to happen now. Hey Scott, I got a lot going on these days. I think you should know. I tippity tip tip dance down my heel to my toe. I got the funky feet and Scott needs to know. Well, it's good to hear from you, Joe, but I don't care, though. Okay, yeah, weirdo, why you joining tap dances? What you need a lesson, some sort of progression to feel a connection? No, watch this. Tippity, tippity, tap, bring it to sing it to bring it back. What are you talking about? Oh, my God, look at that. It is the coolest shit. You put the board down, medals on the bottom on your soul now. Getting hard going down, yeah. Tippity, ribbity, ribbity, back, yeah. Check this out, Scott. I just joined some tap dancing lessons, and I feel like I got my groove. Oh, Joe, that's so cool, my friend. I am so happy to hear from you. Sounds like your life is going real nice. You got a new hobby. You got a new wife. How'd you get that wife, motherfucker? You're asking. I got really good at tap dancing. <laughs> While we're talking, we don't talk often. I know you got this awesome thing that just took off and you want to go ahead and take your top off as you dance and going through, but here you go, here's caution. Watch with them ankles, boy. A strange way to understand this angle, boy. You notice what I'm saying? You can strangle yourself. You employ yourself to deploy, but anything you enjoy, you should do that. It feeds your soul. This is the advice that he got from Joe. As they're on the phone, like, why'd you call me? Yo, Scott, remember the time you went out and danced all night? You were afraid, in the corner, didn't even touch the light. What's with it? What snap one moment? I saw a tap dance and then I had to own it. Hey, Joe! Or Scott, something has changed. No, not a lot. Just a couple simple things I learned at Tibbity Tibbity, Tibbity Tibbity Tap Dancing. Tibbity Tibbity, Tibbity Tibbity Tap Dancing. Tibbity Tibbity, Tibbity Tibbity. Phil, take us to Tap Dance Harmony Town. friends got forget about all that other stuff I made up a hobby cuz I wanted to talk come on you thought I was a tap dancer what the fuck 
But I stick to it, tippity tap. The hip hop, I'm tipping my hat. Listen to what I have, yeah. If you love dance or you love fashion, tattoos come through, you should find your passion. Whatever it is, whether it's tippity tap or ribbity rap, I was white, I had to get over that. A bunch of shit that we gon' do in our lives, but I'm tap dancing, yeah, for the rest of the night. Mr. Scott, Mr. Joe, there's something that you gotta know. I got a new hobby. And it's tippity 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 tap dance. Tippity 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 tap dance. Tippity 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 tap dance. Tippity tippity tippity. That's good. Bring it down and that song. It's fun, right? Because I'm making it all up. That's why it's like a special thing. It's like I didn't plan that. You could never plan that. You'd never know that. Do I have a. a a audience member that would be down to, to come on stage and uh, have a conversation, maybe in this front row. Don't want to put anyone under pressure. I got to give these guys right, right of refusal. They paid the big bucks, but if you're ready, you're ready. You ready? Okay, come have fun. Put your hands together for this lovely lady in the white hat. Welcome, welcome to the stage. Hands together, please, yes. What is your name? Enki. Enki? Enki, like ink, but with a Y, Enki. Okay, beautiful. And um, do you believe in love? <laughs> I mean, if it's good, yeah, why not? <laughs> Enki needs that good, good loving. Yeah. FYI. What's the most romantic thing someone has ever done for you? Oh, it involves frozen strawberries, and I can't talk about it in public. It involves frozen strawberries? I've, I got enough. Go back, sit down. Thank you so much. Hands together for Anki. That's cold fruit and orifices for sure. I don't know which ones. Some frozen raspberries got eight. I don't know which ends. Any musical styling for inspiration from the gentleman or, or, or you guys? Specifically, you or you? Give me a genre of music that you enjoy. Yes. Fucking awesome. Let's get jazzy and uh, we're playing with, this is called Frozen Fruit. <laughs> It's getting, it's getting hot this year. It's getting hot in here. I need to cool down. I need to cool down. It's getting hot in here. What shall we do this year? Let's try something different together. Man, the fridge is empty, but I should check the freezer. Yeah, we should touch each other. Yeah, kiss and tease ya. Well, you gonna put this? I'm taking off my Caesar plus my T-shirt, sitting in the bleachers. What you got? I got a sweet little slushy. I'm spinning it round. Tastes like cherries now. It always tastes like delicious fruit when I'm going down. That's what you were hearing about. The last person, Winnie, I eat it out. Sorry, that's my dad, but this is an evening out. We just gotta get cold inside. We just gotta feel so this time. We should try something different. We got that cold fruit, yeah, I know you. I know what we go through, yeah, I console you. I just want to put this fruit where you don't usually do it, that's okay. But the fluid running down like my veins, you can see either way. Raspberry on your face, strawberry, very messy either way. Yeah, it's scary, you can see it every single day. I Imagine that moment I took those raspberries I put them where the sun don't shine No, no I need a snack Yeah, an evening out We can lead it back to my home It's like I be eating that You can see it get sweeter Sorry, that's the sweetest patch Patch your love, so patch Catch me up, hold that Yeah, man, that's cold, damn! Get that out of my ass, we move it too fast. You fast as hell, get back, back to the moment. Watch this. Baby, you should see me 
tap dance. Baby, you should see me tap dance. And I dive in and I eat it fast. Tap dance. I dive in and then I eat it fast. Damn it, man. I would love to hear a drum solo. Let me hear you make some noise if you would like to hear that also. I think Phil can hold it down with a simplistic kick. While he kicks this, go ahead and show them what percussion looks like. to be adventurous, but I'd be pretending if I would say I had the propensity to try the shit, but that might be more exciting if you stand beside it and have a little more commitment. I'm just saying you dipped, but I told you to leave. You were like, do not pry at me. You cannot find me. Give back my ID. Yeah, yo, I paid the ticket at the door. What are you fucking with me for? Seriously, though, I want to know more. <laughs> just remember that fruits are good for more shit than just Eating directly from the bag and in your hand and in your mouth You can put them somewhere else and go eat it out You see what I'm talking about? Is this awkward? Is this your daughter? <laughs> Fuck, this is awesome You're learning what they get up to How you came through You bust through after he kung fu'd her Yes, sorry But you were a young dude and I'd love to Make this awkward for all three of you and I'd love to Aren't you glad that you came too? She's like, Fuck, man, this is strange, dude But I love that, but I'm banging out Yeah, fruit now and I ate you Take two we got that raspberry We got that frozen fruit, frozen fruit Doing what we not supposed to do You know that raspberry You know that we're not supposed to do That was kinky, was kinky This is lit. I'll keep going. Should I keep going? Yeah. Should I keep going? Okay, cool. Uh, okay, so we need another suggestion, but it has to be rich, you know? It has to be rich. It has to be rich. What are you guys up to? Um, you're right. I should be more specific. What is the dichotomy here? Are, do you guys, are you sexual with each other? No. No, your brother and sister? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is awkward. Is it it's a date? The first date? I just made it weird. <laughs> not just for you, like for me too, like this whole thing's tanking. No, I'm kidding. No, it's not. I'm kidding. I'm having fun here. We're having fun tonight. Um, hold on. Who gave that suggestion? That was weird. weird. I've been doing this for like 10 years, and that's fucking awesome weird. Here you go. If you like drugs. <laughs> um, hey, guys, make a round of, uh, for yourselves, for being involved, for having fun. Um, but no, I want to get back to you guys, really. Uh, what, it, um, what, what is the, f the, um, okay, I gotta leave you guys alone, I'm sorry. <laughs> nah, the second date thing, you guys could get married, oh, hold on, that could be really special. Okay. okay. This is gonna be good. This is gonna be, in, like, your wedding, like, you're gonna be, like, member? Uh, can I ask how you guys met? Um, Tinder. Tinder. High school? High school? No fucking way. High school, then Tinder. But in high school, were you guys attracted to each other? Second Chances? Second Chances. That's the name of this song. It's called Second Chances. Hands together for Second Chances. You know that feeling when you're just scared that it faded away? What's up, buddy? I feel like I'll never get it back again, but... I'm lonely and sad sometimes But I cruise these apps sometimes And I see a familiar face 
I wonder if she'd be down, yeah. Now we can spend some time. High school, I was always high. Believe me, you don't know this guy. Not this time, but in due time, you'll get your second chances. You'll get that other crack at romance. You'll hold on to that second chance if you know just how great it's going. Uh. Let me paint a picture for you. Give this date a year or two. He might put something on you that's a little outdated, but we won't go there right now. But you know when you propose and you get down and you're like, oh no. And she's like, yo bro, this is too fast. Literally, I'm fucking up their second date, laugh. It's all about your second chance. Like world class record plants. Class and you might want to stretch the land or have a band or have a kid or maybe put a wedding band two years from now. He's like, holy shit, this is shit. I wish I didn't come. I'm laughing right now, but we're just having fun. You know what it is when you want a second date. You want to regulate. Now you got to set a vision like you meditate and demonstrate just the type of behavior that you want to have. As a pattern, together you can hold a grasp. But you're in a good time to have a laugh. Nothing's too serious. Don't worry. Don't not call him back. Not on behalf of me. What the fuck? That would be so ugly. I only want pretty things in my life, but sometimes it's hard. Partners do fight, right? Yeah, but then you can just eat her out. You know what I'd be about? Yeah, I change like every single song, but the one thing in common with all of them is the fact that I'm going down. Oh, you can take your second chances. You hold on to it tightly. You know you got your second chances. And this m might just be your life, make tea, or maybe you guys play around with your little tighty whiteies, take it off and run around. Are you renting the hotel? Or are you going back to your house? Sorry, this thinking too far ahead. That was hard to fag now, that my heart is dead. Thumping if you get it for a minute, feel ready to just run it. Go ahead and touch it like you want to touch a rock. school so maybe hopefully you guys fuck tonight right how we doing for time so I'm down and keep rocking I'll just rock with you guys basically all night like basically you won't leave and I'll just keep going you'd be like this is guy insane it's like yeah I can't do anything else um, random word let's do a random three word association we'll do one more song maybe um, and uh, how you doing you doing good you doing good you doing good Word from this side of the room. What what was the first word? Tonsil. Tittle. Tittle. Rambunctious tittle. I got gifted. I got I found a rambunctious tittle. <laughs> this is all love. I love your accent. That's why I took. I see how good I do it. Uh, wrong accent. Fuck for you, but not for me in this song. So I win. I'm kidding, you win, you're here. Thank you so much. Okay, Rambunctious Turtle, let's do one more song. Does that sound good? Okay, no, not really, they don't want to. Call it, guys, bye. When I say rhythm, y'all say flow. Rhythm, rhythm. I know, it's crazy. Okay, cool. Rambunctious Turtle, where is the Rambunctious Turtle? Okay. <laughs> craziest turtle that I've ever seen, ever seen, ever seen. How did you end up here in Jamaica on the beach, on the beach? Everything's so slow around you, but you just won't slow down. This is a new song. 
But I gotta mention going down, holy cow. What's this about? Why this turtle is so tripped out? What he took cocaine for, what now? Oh, that turtle just came out near that ship. That's a pirate ship, and they trying to dip. Where can we find this? I think a drug bus just came through, and two cops came right by us on a big bus. This turtle's fucked up on coke. That's crazy. Best song I ever wrote. What's with all these rambunctious turtles? I'm not sure it's running circles. What's with this rambunctious turtle? Wrong accent, I know. Fucking spilling around the beach, yeah. What you talking about? Around the waves to see, I mean, are you playing me? Amazing, I must be hallucinating. Cause I just took 16 tabs of acid. Damn, that's the fastest turtle I ever seen. I'll try to grab it. Oh, hold on, I get it. It has no shell, that's a lizard. <laughs> What's with these rambunctious turtles? Who gave these turtles coke? <laughs> Mate, that's your fucking rambunctious turtle! Wrong <laughs> accent, I know. <laughs> Woo! came to Jamaica to say that I want to go sailing, but no way. I just found that I'm so close to these lizards that they hang in the front of the waves. Right near the beach dock, and we got new ways to save it. These heat racks won't stop. What are they doing? They're reptilian. Let me go again, man. I'm a silly man. I didn't see that they didn't have a shell. That's OK. Hold on. Pass me hookah shell. Yeah, I do that myself. Is you moving well? What are the fucking next thing is just moving around? Everywhere that I go, am I hallucinating? Demonstrating all these psilocybins that I've been taking aside of my mind. And you know I'm rhyming. She's like, oh, fucking Ron accent. That's fine then. All right then. High five, friend. In Jamaica, we'll be playing. We'll be slow, crazy reptiles in the sand, man. This is crazy as fucking turtle. I can't believe I've ever seen running around like that. He was all underneath my beach shit and everything. I absolutely cannot believe that this turtle's so fast inside of Jamaica. Oh my god, I'm high on acid. <laughs> Ridiculously fast turtles, I'm gonna get off stage after this, but I do fast hurdles like I'm talking to the flow. If you rockin', here we go. Thanks for coming to the show. Yeah, rhythm and flow. I am 11. Follow me on IG, you can find me. Yeah, I be free people inside the one. That's why I'm 11. Yeah, like me, myself, and Irene. Crazy, like Jim Carrey, too. Yeah, Bar Cathedral, so I'm praying for you. We're making it cool. If you're taping the news, you're a sheep. Fuck all of you. I'm joking, I'm an asshole. Man, that's damn, though. Yeah, let me pull it back right like a lasso. That's Rap, bro. Thank you very much for letting us go in your one hour. Break it to the percussion, you get it, keep it in Russian. There's nothing that's super cold like the war over there in Russia. Get it, kill it, crush it. It's a rambunctious tittle. It's a rambunctious show. We all had a real good time. Started with an ohm. So you know where to go for your daily flows. I'm 11, yo. Michael Harrison about to close the show. Let's go.
Make sure to eat girls out. See what I am all about? Quick lips, get this, yeah, quick fit, you get me in a quick six top pick, like I'm winning the lottery. How you think I get the girls that wanna swap with me? I mean, obviously, they're swatting at me like a fly. She's like, stop talking to me, it's my parents right here. I'm talking about this, man, that's weird. 